I've just received a Brot 20 little flail mower. I got it from a guy down in Norwich. Um, it's got a few things wrong with it that I'm going to try and fix. Brakes. I think it's just the cables are seized. I need to check that. It's got this neat little folding step on the front. It's a good little mower. It folds up to um, about four foot long, four foot high and just over two foot wide. You can move the steering and the seating position a bit left to right or the, the foot position. You can move it over on this sliding bar here with this nut. You can raise and lower the deck with this knob. That's your throttle, steering link and in here you've got a flail. Which you can see the blades there. I'll show a bit more of that. It's got a big split roller on the back so it'll go around corners and it's got this Briggs engine on it which I'll try and identify the date on. It's quite an old one. There will be an S printed on it there but it has a spark. It's got a step on the back to hold the bags and inside it's a bit of a mess. It's meant to have it's meant to have a chain to drive the um, the rollers. It's your main drive. They're driven off this shaft here, which is driven by a chain which comes from an Albion gearbox. The motor drives a lay shaft, which drives the gearbox. So you got your speed your speeds are completely out of the gearbox, but the lay shaft also drives a centrifugal clutch, just like on a chainsaw or a strimmer or that. And that drives the flails underneath. It's got this tensioner pulley as well, I guess. Um, it's quite a simple affair, really. It's got three forward speeds. Three, two, and one. Neutral and reverse. Um, everything's a bit ropey on it, because it's been lying up for years, but there's nothing on it that seems to be too difficult to fix. The exhaust is knackered. But, again, it's just a matter of getting a new one. Working from there.